I'm T. Basil Sturb, and thanks for tuning in to Tough Bible Questions. If you want to see videos from past Bible studies or other inspirational videos, check out my YouTube channel, Power of Truth TV with T. Basil Sturb. And don't forget to subscribe to receive more videos as they are uploaded. This question comes from Rose. Dear Pastor, please explain the text absent from the body at present with the Lord. This text rose is found in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 8. But in order for us to get the context of this verse, we need to read the preceding verses. The Apostle Paul is addressing the fact that this physical body is wasting away, but God has another one for us that will never be diminished. So 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 1 and 2, we find these words. For we know that if this tent that is of our earthly home is destroyed, we have a building from God, a house not made with hands, eternal in the heavens. Verse 2 says, For in this tent we groan, longing to put on our heavenly dwelling. In other words, there is a longing to occupy the glorified body, and there's a longing for Paul to be with the Lord. So he's requesting to be with the Lord right away. And his point is, he's looking forward to that day when he will further be clothed with incorruption. Verses 6 to 8 says, Therefore, we are always confident, knowing that while we are at home in this body, we are absent from the Lord. For we walk by faith and not by sight. We are confident, therefore, and willing rather to be absent from this body and present with the Lord. I like the way it reads in the English Standard Version, verses 6 to 8. So we're always of good courage. We know while we're at home in this body, we are from the Lord. But we're walking by faith and not by sight. So yes, we are of good courage and would rather be absent from this body and present with the Lord. This is the desire of every Christian. We're all willing rather to be absent from this body and present with the Lord. Some persons believe that the text means as soon as we die and leave this body, we are present with the Lord. So pastor, when will we be present with the Lord if that doesn't happen as soon as we die? We find the answer in 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verses 16 to 18. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God, and the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together to meet the Lord in the clouds, to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall we always be with the Lord. Comfort one another with these words. So when a person dies, they rest in the grave, but they won't be there forever. Jesus is coming again, and when he does, the dead in Christ shall rise in the first resurrection, and we will be incorruptible. I hope this helps you a little bit, Rose, and I hope that the Bible questions that you sent to me, I was able to answer. Thank you so much. Let's get ready now for our Bible study this evening. Grab pen, notepad, and let's pray and dig into the Word.